I'm in downtown Charleston. This is the historic district where we're seeing what is the uh, eye wall of Hurricane Matthew coming through. A lot of wind, a lot of rain here. Now, let me show you what's going on. A little bit of debris in the roadway, but you can really see the trees moving now. We've seen wind gusts of up to 25 miles an hour in this section. Now, I'm very protected here with all of the buildings that are around closer to the coast, closer to the water. They're seeing wind gusts of up to 50 miles per hour, but the real concern concern here is not only the wind blowing over trees and whatnot, but also the storm surge. Charleston itself has seen a nine-foot storm surge. There is significant flooding in this area. Also down south towards Tybee Beach and Savannah, Georgia, there is considerable flooding in that area. Now, the Georgia governor has actually called up another 1,000 uh, National Guard troops. That makes 2,000 positioned throughout Georgia. There's also National Guard here in the South Carolina. Carolina area. Rescue crews are positioning themselves around to make sure that they are prepared when this is all over to go in and be able to help folks that need help. Reporting in Charleston, Edward Lawrence, CBS 2 News.